So now let's see what the apply mask option does uh, to our mask right here. So I'm going to go around onto a uh, layer and then I'm going to add a mask which hides out everything. So if I were to click and drag right here, I can work around with the mask. So I can go around, let's say, add in a bit of a gradient effect as well. So in order to make this mask permanent, so right now what is happening is that if I were to draw it, you can see that I can still bring out uh, effects right here. I can remove these things out. But if I were to go around and apply the mask, which you can access by going around over here, or you can go, go and access it from the layer menu, and then you can click on apply mask. So once you do that, what happens is that now the change is permanent, meaning if I were to draw out now, you can see that nothing actually pops up. So now what is happening is that it has converted the mask into pixel and now you cannot edit anymore. So if I were to go around into lasso mask, let's say, for example, if I were to remove it, I can remove it. But if I were to actually go around on add to mask, you can see that after I use the apply mask feature, it has it has applied the mask that we previously worked with. And then now if I were to work with further masks, then I cannot bring in the previous uh, pixels. So unless you really want uh, the mask uh, to, be, uh, to uh, be permanent, you should not use the apply mask. But if you need to, then you can use apply mask to make it permanent. So that is how you can use the apply mask feature inside of Pixlr E. So hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.